So I've studied leadership for over two decades. I did my thesis on leadership. I've worked with thousands of executives all over the country. I wrote an off-the-shelf facilitator training program, Courageous Leadership. I wrote a book on courage and leadership with Courage Goes to Work and another book on risk taking. I, feel I, I thought I knew a lot about this idea of leadership. And uh, one day, my five-year-old son came home from school and he had gotten to be the class leader for the day. Now this is a big deal. I do leadership de development for a living. I design and develop leadership programs and I feel like I'm pretty well schooled in the idea of leadership. And my five-year-old son got to be the leader. So I was like, hey man, class leader, how cool is that? Give me a high five. What'd you get to do as class leader? I thought he was gonna say, well, you know, I lined them all up in a straight line and I marched in front of them and we moved forward, you know, some, sort of that command and control kind of leadership. And that's not, he looked at me and said, I got to open doors for people. I got to open doors for people. And I thought about that statement and all the people that had made a true difference in my life as leaders, people that I looked up to and admired. And there were always people who had given me a shot. They had opened up a door of opportunity where other people hadn't given me that chance before. They let me prove myself to myself. I think within five minutes I knew there was a book concept there. And so I turned it into a book called Leaders Open Doors. And it's really about that idea that good leaders are people that focus on opportunity for us. They create opportunities for the people they serve and the organizations that they serve. And to make the book come to life, I had to sort of figure out how, what's the best way for the book to live its own value system. And I decided to donate 100% of the book's royalties to programs that support kids with special needs because they're not always so capable of opening doors themselves and they need help from leaders to be able to do that. And so I've donated 100% of the royalties of the book to programs that support kids with special needs. And you can find the book at leadersopendoors.com.